Probably her, but there is an ANA guy with me now, over. It's, it is what it is. I mean, like, this is freaking this first ridge line. And then between this ridge line and that next one, there's like, like a pretty decent drop off. And then when you go up there and you follow this ridge line up and you go right there, it's like a big freaking flat area. It's about this big. And right there, that's, that's the Pakistan border. So, I mean, you, if you go up there, there's burn marks from when they shoot rockets at the cop and the OP. Uh, this last one they did when they shot was like 13, 14 rockets. They shot several of them at the OP instead of at the cop because they were trying to hit the construction equipment and the camera. All the time, sir. Hey, you call it the bar, you call it the bar. I mean, as they say, they also, this is like sort of like, they say it's like a training area for them. Uh, for their, for like, their training, like we do our training. They use this area a lot as a training for guys to go further in country because it's easy to supply them, bring them in, and take them back out. That's why you'll see like um, a lot of difference in like how good the, 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 the IDF, the indirect fire crews are with the mortars and rockets. Because some of the guys are really good, they got spotters, they bracket onto the cop or the fob, and then some guys they'll shoot, and they'll shoot like eight rounds, and they'll all hit like way away from the cop. Training. Yeah, they do. They, uh, some of the guys in that night of the 30th of October attack, they have, it's like, uh, it, it, the, it's like the Wazira Senate Agency. They have like a, it's like a handbook, like similar to, it's like almost exactly like our Ranger handbook that goes over advanced infantry tactics and, uh, you know, small unit uh, ambush raids, that sort of thing. And a couple of the guys that were in that attack had their version of that. Just basically, like, they, had, like, they had drawings of the cop and the OP, you know, measurements, distances, all that sort of thing. And uh, it was pretty, it was pretty, I mean, high speed stuff for them. You know, you wouldn't think they'd have anything like that, but they did. Mm -hmm. So, uh, like I said, the, the crew we have here now I think is pretty good because last attack they've actually bracketed it onto the cop and hit pretty close and they actually hit up here, which is usually pretty difficult for them to do.